Bonjour. How are you guys? <laughs> how's, the, how's the honeymoon? Married man. How's it's going good. You just ruined it. Whoa, buddy. Ding, ding, ding. Oh, my. thinking about coming right now though yeah i'm here all right Good morning, Nub Nation! Bow, 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 bow. Bow, 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 bow. We are less than 48 hours. We are actually 36 hours from our flight to France. And of course we're driving. So currently, we have a lot of stuff to do before we leave. Step one, pick up my 5.6 Barracuda that has traveled around the world once with me. My most trusty board, my favorite surfboard. I left it at the Ding Dynasty to get fixed. And now, it is ready for the journey. Let's go. This is what it's all about, dude. Somebody's gotta get two in France. What? Look at this, dude. What's this all about? I just thought the purple looked cool. Uh -huh. I love that. Feels See, good though, right? The Ding Dynasty does it again. Still no Instagram page, but you can find them at Will Booth Bay. Wow, so it looks really good, Will. Well. came into the Ding Dynasty with gray rails. Smashed, smashed, ding, 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 ding. Refresh. Ding, 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 ding. Destroyed, ding. <laughs> Thin box. Thin box was busted out. This one, right? No, yeah. You can't see anything with my shot. Now it's coming out of the shop, the shop, the factory. Purple, a new board. How new much extra is that, 50? For you? Yeah. 500. <laughs> <laughs> coming out with a faded purple rail. You like the purple though? It's a brand new board. It's a brand new board. I thought you'd look really good getting tubed in Osager with, with like purple rails. It's I just, perfect. you know, I was like. I like it. Yeah, right? The board looks great. Board acquired, step two. I got three brand new wetsuits from Hyperflex. Thank you, Hyperflex. And now I decided to leave them in the back of my Sprinter van in California. So the only place that I could get a suit in time was Wave Hog Surf Shop, worldwide distributor. Always a sight to behold at Wave Hog. Some action happening here. Old school boards. How are you? You got one? Three two or? Three two large one. Dude. You're a legend. What's good about this suit? It's soft, it's stretchy, it's price point, it keeps you warm. It comes with a one year warranty on all the stitching. Ben so, serves for Hyperflex, so it goes right back to Ben, keeps him in the water. Why wouldn't they just run down the wave hog right now and get one? They should. <laughs> Not used to fall surfing, so I'm trying to do something that will actually float me. Okay. And, uh, Whoa, buddy. Shaped by Mark Richards. Uh -huh. One of the boards he won. If you look it up, you'll find it's online that he won the world title on. But what? Yeah, so I'm restoring it for. True classic. That's collectible. <laughs> that You're gonna have to restore. That'll be on eBay under the vintage section. <laughs> you'll have to restore that someday. Fuck this guy off. Dude, great seeing you. Have fun. You don't want trip. me to film the interaction? Like, no way. Oh, yeah, dude. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Thank you. Can we take it? Are yeah. you good? Oh, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks, man. No worries, dude. Of course. I've been following you forever. Your story's awesome. Thank you. Sober and everything. Thank you That's very huge, much. dude. Thank you. That is an inspiration and then some. I appreciate it, dude. Yeah, man. All right. Sweet. I don't want to hold you good up. Good luck finding nice the new board, dude. Thank you very much. If it ends up being a Ben Gravy, send me a picture. Oh, I, I definitely will. I definitely <laughs> will. Yeah, I didn't even, like, I hadn't seen a lot of your fiberglass stuff and oh, yeah. you showed me. Sounds like you need to menace. Yeah. 
He's got the menace. You think? <laughs> <laughs> Should we go look at it real quick? Let's see your potential board here. No pressure, dude, just because I'm filming. <laughs> Don't buy anything just because I'm filming. <laughs> dude, Ben's got a trip he's got to pay for. I know. Whoa. Yeah, this is what he showed me the other day. Nice. That is. Yeah, he's looking for something that is not quite a long board, but he's struggling on some like his crowd killer. This is kind of falls right in between where he still has volume under the nose where it's still not too pulled in. The tail's still full. The rails are thick, but they're turned down, not like a brick, so you can still turn them, making it user friendly with performance. Single, double, flows water. Yeah, my biggest issue is lift. just staying on top and being able to being able to actually catch, you know, catch it. Cause I'm, I'm mostly longboard. And to be honest, I surf foam. I have a wave storm. I was actually surfing in Barbados and the, the guy I was surfing with is like, dude, just go get a foamy for now. You'll catch every wave out there. Well, this is going to get you in. The seven six is, is money. I have a seven zero and a seven six. I hardly ever ride the seven six because it's too big for me. Essentially, yeah, yeah. I'm only I'm only seven zero guy. What's the problem? The problem is that's like the only boys that are selling. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a problem, brother. Yeah, he, he grabbed it. He got a uh, he got a fiberglass spin with it, and he's gonna go out. He's coming back for the board swap tomorrow. Got the seven six. Tom, Tom, you animal. Ten more dollars. Too dusty. Oh, we can't give it there anymore. Dennis's rescue shut down. Where we've adopted Dennis from his rescue shut down. We got you, Den. You came from ACT. You were oh, you were at a kill shelter. That's horrible. <laughs> My son was at a kill shelter. All right. We got a lot going on because it was such a short time between the California trip and leaving for France. So first things first, well actually like third things first, Smy World, new Smy World Vaporwave release. Comic-Con exclusive, but you can get the merchandise. Jay Vern, you're missing it. Full, full nuke city, full nuke City, oh my. This is 100% my plane outfit. Full Nuke City. Full Nuke City, just like a one-off drop. And the Comic-Con exclusive Vaporwave Gravy. So this guy's only gonna be available at Comic-Con. Maybe if you hit up Smy World, you might be able to figure out how to get one, but there's gonna be 200 of these. Probably the sickest one we've done so far. 100% actually. Vaporwave Gravy, dreaming. We also got big old box from Sanook. These are gonna have to wait a little bit. I would claim these are for winter. What do we got here? Ooh, the champagne, fluffy. What? Jordan, these are for you. Oh my gosh. Jordan, come here. Oh. Are you claiming these? Those are mine? Yeah, look. Wow. Size eight. These are really cool. I'll wear these all winter. That's what I'm saying. Wow. And they're a little glitz, glitz and glam. Let's see what I got. Ooh. Mine are twinning. Mine are blacked out, dude. Wait, I like mine. Wait, I love mine. What else we got? What else we got? Nothing for Paris yet. The hunt continues. Oh, these are yours too. Oh, I like, I don't want, you know, I. Let's see, the hunt continues. More winter. All right, we got the sugar light. Bango. The hunt continues, the hunt continues. All right, all right, low top, I like them. Winter must be coming. Oh, dude, we got some loafers. This is perfect for Patty. That's good for Patty. Dude, these are the gray, though. All right, I'm gonna be officially Where's, loafing. Where's the box? I'm officially loafing. So thank you, Sanook. We're dreaming. Yeah, I, like I got two new pairs of shoes for France. Thank you. Thank you for the dream. Bye. What are you doing? <laughs> Out of everything that I do in my whole life and the amazing things that I get to do every month or every week, 
I pretty much get to do something that's amazing, like a dream come true of mine. Right now, what I'm doing right now is my absolute favorite thing to do in the entire world. Literally go to the beach with my wife and my dog and watch Dennis run as fast as he possibly can. There's nothing that fills my heart more. <laughs> Look at him go! So we're leaving for France tomorrow morning. Actually, tomorrow night. Forgot. It's a night flight. And we're gonna miss Dennis. It's gonna be heartbreaking, but he'll be all right at grandma's, but it's hard to leave. He has good grandparents that take good care of him, so. Dreaming. He's dreaming too. I forgot to film anything, but here we go. Harry. Look at the bus! Oh, he's pissed. But don't we have a green? Like, we had a green before them. Yeah, we ours was Go. green. Go! This is gnarly. The, uh, what am I supposed to do? I don't know, but this is crazy. Like, who's gonna cause the this accident? This gonna have to let me go. Oh god, oh god, oh god. The Dude, biker. What One man is biker. Going oh, on. Okay, whatever, we're fine, we're fine. Just stay here, just stay here. Just go with the biker, the biker, the biker, the biker. Oh my god, look at the pretty flower shop though. Yeah, but dude, you realize like I didn't have, there was no traffic laws in that no way. I fought, god. I fought through that entire intersection. There was no, no, <laughs> no laws at all. <laughs> it's Even with the lights. <laughs> to Paris, France. We're here in our luxurious hotel room. The other thing that's happening right now, we're crossing paths with an old friend, a man that's been gallivanting Europe for two weeks, most recently seen at the Munich Wave Pool doing laybacks. This is how I ruined Jamie O'Brien's honeymoon in Paris. Jamie, yo, wasn't him, I guess. I haven't seen him in a while. Yeah, Jamie. Wait, where's Job? Where's T.O.B.? Tuna O'Brien. This is dangerous. Bonjour. How are you guys? Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Bonjour. How are you? Good to see you. What's Hi. up? How are you? How's the honeymoon? Good to see you. It's great. Hey. What's up? Oh, oh God. <laughs> What else is good? This guy's married. How's Mar the, how's the honeymoon? Married man. How's it's going month? good. You just ruined it. <laughs> <laughs> How'd you know that was my title? I, I knew it. I ruined Jamie O'Brien's uh, honeymoon. How'd you know? That was it. Now you could use it because I actually said it and it was real. Like, you ruined everything. Have you ever seen the Eiffel Tower? I have a long time ago. Oh, you have? Yeah. All right. Well, I'm about, seeing it for you? the first time. Nah. I saw Mona Lisa today. Really? She was just hanging out. The real one? Yeah. I heard they put a fake one. I in heard there. maybe that too, but <laughs> there's a bulletproof case around the whole thing, so something's going on there. What's Tom claiming? Yeah. Tom. Tom. He ruined What's... our honeymoon. <laughs>
Second best honeymoon I've ever been on. Woohoo! Mahalo, Jamie. <laughs> Woke up in New Jersey, lived a whole day, zero sleep, zero sleep on a plane. Now we're e-biking around Paris. What the hell is going on? What'd you say? He wants one, doesn't he? Red Bull. We have Red Bull. Nah, Red Bull's better. This makes you go shishi How much is that? Too much, dude. That's not. No, we don't drink. Sorry. <laughs> How? How do you know? From his videos? <laughs> He's gonna lose his stock. You know, and I know he drinks. I saw him. <laughs> Why does he want it so bad? He's not acting like he wants it. If I'm being. <laughs> <laughs> we made it. I guess I died on that bike ride. I guess all my good deeds actually brought me to heaven, Jordan. How many credit cards you got, Jamie? None. We're going in. <laughs> Are you going all cash business today? Yeah, I got a freaking. Can pipe it more that one? Oh, park over here. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Walk over the bridge on the left. Then in 700 feet, take a right on Kajak Chirac. Not firing. Here we are, Paris, France. This is the world famous Eiffel Tower. And I'm gonna tell you right now, this is a view you're not gonna get anywhere else on Earth. This is an authentic view of the Eiffel Tower from the streets, the streets where everyone shares a view. Citizenship, people from all over the world come together to see this magnificent sight. Behold. Country, Paris in particular, has really did did me in. I've what's the word that's just saying? Like I can't believe we're here. Everywhere else, like I feel like I was gonna get there maybe one day. Never thought I'd get to Paris. I say this every time though. This is crazy. It's crazy being in Paris. Really crazy. We got the Eiffel Tower in the background, sparkling. It's just so nice. The beautiful river here. Like we're in. The, the city of love. Bustling streets. Me, Ben, and JT. <laughs> <laughs>
Day one, current croissant count, zero. Oh, it's raining. Uh, what the? What do you think? They all croissant. My favorite thing ever, but I'm looking for an almond croissant. I haven't seen one. Official croissant count, one. No. Mm -hmm. well, we didn't name. film the other ones. Okay, one. How many? One. one. Whoever eats the most croissants to the end of the week gets to give the other people in the crew a lifelong nickname. That will stick forever in the vlog. We we're gonna say Javen. <laughs> so you're gonna make eat the most croissants. She's gonna carry it around all day till it turns as hard as a rock. No, I'm not. It's more, I'm literally gonna start eating it. First time checking the waves in France. Not expecting much this morning, but it's always nice to look at the ocean. So here we are checking it. Look at that behind me. Wow. Beautiful. I'm out of breath. First morning in France. Forecast one to two feet. Conditions offshore, perfect. The waves are really, really fun. I kind of wish I had my soft tops, but I gotta pick them up later. So here we are. First day in France. We found something at least for the dream.
Dude, the sea glassing is legit. Look at this. This one's good. The guy out there asked me if I peed in my wetsuit. And I was like, wee wee. Wee wee. I peed in my pants. <laughs> First session, full blown success. No success, success for all. Sea glass. JT got to experience the real world for once and the natural world, the beach, and then I got to catch a couple waves. For a zero to one forecast or a one to two forecast, thank you, Surfline. <laughs>